experience as this is hit high in the air over to left center to the wall and it's going to land in front of the wall. Runner being waved around. Here comes Brandon Grover and he will score the first post 77 run of the season. It's an RBI triple for Jackson Hornung. That one is low and here comes Horning to try to score and he will easily 2-0 post 77. We met early today, uh, a couple hours before the game, and we talked about having an approach, um, what that means, what it should be. Um, and they came out and they executed that perfectly. You know, they were, uh, they were fantastic. I mean, it was great. These guys love backing me up. They back up everyone. So they knew uh, we were still down a little bit from that game a couple days ago, but they just picked us up. Knew, uh, they knew we had to go out here today and get a W. So, you know, first goal of the year was to get more uh, wins than last year. So we had to start off today strong. So, you know. And this is hit in the air over to center field. That'll get down. Sam Farrell will cross home plate. And Brennan Grover still marching up towards second. It's an RBI double. Got some wheels like Brandon Grover. Lopari working from the stretch. Rudder taking off. This is hit in the air over to center field. That'll get down for a hit. And now being waved around is Hornung. Here he comes, and he will score. It's going to be an RBI double for Dom Cavanaugh. Well, as a team, we definitely came in like fired up, ready to score some runs, play defense, and um, it felt good right away to, you know, get some runs in. And, um, you know, I guess we just focused all game and tried to do what we do best, which is just, you know, I don't know, score runs and play D. Uh, it seems like uh, you guys have a laid-back attitude and seem to have a lot of fun out there playing with each other. Uh, what's it been like playing with this group? Um, we're laid-back, but um, we also have, like, um, you know, we're – we're serious at the same time, and we, we have goals, and we're doing everything with purpose. So, But it's definitely really fun, especially because we all get along and we're winning. So. Leg lift and the pitch. And he'll get a piece of this one into left field. It goes past the reach of the shortstop. Lead runner being waved around. Here comes Dante Diavazzo. The throw in is going to get away from the catcher, and that is going to be run number three for post 77. Diavazzo with a bit of a collision with the catcher, Nickerson. Slow roller picked up by the third baseman. Throw to first, got him! Nice play by Dom Cavanaugh. It's it's great playing together. It's great practicing together. I'm always having a fun time. We're always having a fun time. The coaches love it. We just love being together. Can explain what the Gandhi statue is all about. Um, so basically, we're looking for a thing to like be a rallying sort of symbol for us. Um, so every day we recognize the player of the game um and this was just something funny the uh the kids stumbled upon i think maddie actually took it from uh, his history teacher um and the guy was like all right i don't care who took it but you guys better do some fun with it so we turned it into the mvp trophy each game so he travels with the team stays overnight with the winner i put my cap on him during games sometimes kids rub them before they go up to bat uh, but yeah it's just been a fun thing to like build on social media um, and just uh, add a little more added competition. Oof. And that must have hurt. So the runner that scored might have run out of the base path. The umpires are going to talk about it. The Hudson coaches arguing that he remained in the base path, and they're calling him safe, so it's a 3-1 to one game. And I think that call... And... Jake Obed, certainly not happy. And Kavanaugh gets a piece of this one over to left field. And that is going to drop just in front of the fence. One run is in. Here comes another run trying to score, and he will. And that is going to be a two RBI double for Dom Kavanaugh. And this is hit in the air over to left field. And see you. Did that go out? No, it dropped just in front of the fence. A run is going to come in to score. Lawrence Tang has his first hit as a member of post 77. That's going to, oh, the umpire is chewing both dugouts out. And Cameron Tabo on camera. I'm Tom Nappy, and we thank you for watching Ashland Legion Baseball on either WACA TV in Ashland or H. Cam in Hopkinton or H. Cat in Holliston. Thanks for joining us. We will talk to you again very soon. Take care and be well.
Post 77 took the game 9 to 2 and with the win they improved to 13 and 1 and clinched the number 1 spot in the zone playoffs. I'm I'm always confident when he's back there. I know that I can throw some strikes to him and he'll, you know, he'll catch it. Well, it's all out of love, right? All out of, of course, all out of love. It's a well good cop bad cop with Sean sometimes, but you know. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> We asked a lot of them, and great teams, they come out and they respond. And that's exactly what we did today. We got on them early. We scored every, we scored every inning besides the sixth, and we had a runner on third. Um, and I pinch it for a kid who's batting 500 to get a kid in the Focus. Um, I just, I love this group. I mean, we have a lot of fun, as you can tell. Um, kids like this coming in, making strides, stepping up for us in big ways. Hi. Hi. Cole Glassburn really struggled today, though. Yeah. I mean, what do you guys say about his performance? Yeah, I mean, Cole, uh, Cole sucks, and just plain and simple. Uh, I mean, I wish I didn't have to pay, play him, but, you know, he pays me 50 bucks a game to put him out there. So, oh, my bad, my bad. Uh, no, Cole's great. Um, no, this group's awesome. I mean, it's a good first accomplishment, which I think we'll have many of. <laughs> <laughs> and this is ripped up the right side. Jewett with the play throw to first. Not oh, a problem. unbelievable play by Sean Jewett. That was the greatest four to three I've ever seen. Second baseman of the year right there. Okay. This is a slow roller up the right side that'll bounce off of Rankator. Jewett picks it up. Throw over. He got him. Sean Jewett. With another great wow. defensive play, he's, second baseman of the year. I'll he owns you. he owns the Gandhi now. You can't take it away from him. Oh, absolutely. Line up in the pitch. Gets a piece of this one, and that's over the reach of the shortstop. Grover around 30 is flying home for the 10th post-77 run of the afternoon. An RBI single for Jackson Hornung. And is the mercy rule going into effect? Yes, it is. And he'll get a piece of this one up the left side. In the left field it goes. Here comes a run, and it's a two to two ball game. Jackson Hornung scores. An RBI single for Sean Jewett. And right up in the pitch. There's a bunt by Glassburn up the middle. A run will score. It's a three to two game, and Glassburn's going to be. Was he out? He yep. was out, but he got the job done. Dom Cavanaugh comes flying around. Uh just score some runs and guys came up big when they needed to be and it uh, feels really good because now we're in a really good position to win District 5 so we're really excited and we're just proud of our guys for stepping up. You get on, I'm going to score one of you guys and you know I came out there when they called the time and uh, they were talking to the pitcher, I went out to Obes and Babs and I said guys I'm getting this guy in, we're tying up this game right now and you know I did that, I look over. That's what happened. Kavanaugh is pumped up at third. Done deal. <laughs> yeah, I'm pumped up at first, and we got the energy. We had the momentum there. A bit of a wet surface, and Cole Glassburn will have the double. Whoops. I told you he was playing too shallow. Uh-oh. Blacko. The lights have gone off. One, two. Gets a piece of this one. That's a rope into left field. One run is in to score. Here comes Hornung around third. He will score as well. And it's 2 0 post 77. A two RBI single for Dom Kavanaugh. And he'll rip this up the first baseline. And that is going to be a hit for Regatory. One run is in. Here comes another run. And two are going to score for post 77. It's a 5 2 ball game. A two RBI single for Drew Regatory. Line up and the pitch. And this is hit in the air over to center field, and that is caught! Brandon Grover with a tremendous catch for the final out. And Ashland Legion post 77 are your zone five champions. Ashland Legion is going to the state tournament where they will play 10 a.m. Fino Field against the Zone 4 champs, Shrewsbury. Ashland Legion post 77 gets the job done. And for the second time in the past three years, they are heading to the state tournament. This team from day one made a commitment to get to the Elite Eight, and we're there now, and 
where our next goal is to win the state. Period. End of story. And this is hit in the air over to left field, and that'll get down. Lead runner being waved around. Here he comes. The throw in is not in time, and it's a tie game. An RBI single for Nick Calabrese. Alex Amalfi scores. And Rankatori up to second, and we are knotted at three here in the bottom of the sixth. And this is hit up the right side into right field. It goes. And the go-ahead run is going to score for Post 77, a runner behind him. And it's a 5-3 ball game. A two RBI single for Brandon Grover. Okay. Uh, we don't quit. As you guys have seen, we do not quit. Um, and we're never out of a game. And it was it was special to see today. It really was. Well, can you believe Larry was shocked? Uh, he just didn't expect it. I mean, His jaw dropped, you know. Yeah, Larry sucks. I mean, what can I say, you know? <laughs> Larry's the worst of all time. So I don't know why Larry's in, in the booth on the staff, you know. But uh, he, he pays us he is, to yeah. be on the staff. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, he pays me to let him let him hang around, too. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, no, Larry has little to no faith in us, and I mean, it, it, it just motivates us that much more. <laughs> Well, Larry always has a negative attitude. They're a good team. Those uh, the top of the order, the middle of the order, were pretty good. So they kind of got at me at the beginning. But then I had I through the fourth inning, I heard the announcer say I had like 70 pitches. So I knew that I had to bear down and just keep throwing strikes to win it. So that's all I did. Um, my thought was just see ball, hit ball, and. Um, I did that in the first at bat, flew out, and I knew that um, I was getting a pretty good swing on it. And so I just kind of let my my teammates hype me up. They're always giving energy in the dugout, and I could hear them at the plate. And uh, I just took that into my at bat, and was luckily able to put a good swing on it. We'll swing at this one right back up the middle, and here comes the winning run. Post 77 lives to see another day of the state tournament. Kevin Balowitz scores the winning run in RBI. Base hit for Jackson Hornung. And it's a walk-off win for Ashland post 77 over Somerset. Just like to shout out Somerset's coach for making me play in the game. I only need one labrum, but thanks, buddy. We appreciate you guys. Thank you. Awesome, especially after waiting those two hours. I just wanted one more at bat and uh, came with that opportunity, so I just had to take advantage of it. And for him to sit out for almost two hours, and you know, I, I got Dom loose, I got Louie loose. I, I was I was a little concerned um, with Cole waiting around that long, but um, you know, he just the whole time was like, "You're not taking me out of this game. Like, there's no shot. Like, you're not taking me out of this game." And so, I mean, he stepped up for us all year. I was gonna let him do it again. He did. So it was awesome. Wow! Rain, rain, go away. We got to play this game and finish it right. We got her done tonight. We're excited. We're in the final four. And uh, we're going to keep going. We're going to keep winning till we lose. And we don't plan on losing. Thank you very much. Take care. Hornung gets a piece of this up the left side. That's a fair ball. The third baseman didn't even move. One run is in. 5 nothing. post 77. Sean Jewett over one and was hit by a pitch. Puts this one up the middle in his center field. It goes. Hornung being waved around here. He comes to try to score. The throw is cut off by the pitcher. And it's 3 nothing. post 77. An RBI single for Sean Jewett. Ashland took the game 3 to nothing. Luke Gustafson went the distance, giving up no runs on five hits and struck out four. Ashland post 77's tremendous season came to an end with 21 wins and five losses. Congratulations to head coach Jake Obit on an absolutely amazing first year at the helm and all the post 77 players for bringing Ashland to Legion Baseball further than they have ever gone before. Everyone in the Post 77 organization should be extremely proud of what they accomplished.